Having a macOS bootable USB is valuable, especially when your Mac cannot start up and you need to reinstall macOS on your Mac computer. In this video, I'll show you the step-by-step -step process to create a macOS bootable USB on a Windows PC. This tutorial applies to all the Mac versions like Sonoma, Ventura, Monitory, etc. To create a macOS bootable USB installer, you need a USB drive with at least 16 GB of storage space. Its data will be erased when making the bootable installer. So be sure to backup all your files before proceeding. First of all, we'll convert the USB drive to a GPT partition scheme so that it works on a Mac. To do so, run command prompt as an administrator. Type the disk part command. To view the disk number of a USB drive, type list disk. Now you need to select the USB drive. In my case, it's disk 1. Clean the disk. Now type convert GPT to convert the USB drive to the GPT partition scheme. Then create a primary partition. The USB drive is now ready. Next, you need to download the DMG file of the macOS version you want to use. You can directly download it from Apple's official website. But here, you'll only get the older macOS versions. So I'm gonna download the image file from the Internet Archive website. Here, you'll find the macOS image files for all macOS versions such as Sonoma, Ventura, Monetary, Big Sur, etc. Please remember, your Mac cannot boot from a USB containing a macOS version older than the one the computer shipped with. For example, if your Mac came with macOS 12 Monetary, it won't boot from macOS 11 Big Sur installer, because it is the older version. In this case, you can use macOS 12 Monetary itself, or a newer version like macOS 13 Ventura, or macOS 14 Sonoma. So be sure to download a DMG file that is compatible with your Mac model. I have an M-chip MacBook, so I'm gonna download the latest Sonoma DMG file. Now, to create a macOS bootable USB on Windows, we'll use a tool called TransMac. You can get it by searching on Google. Just download and install it on your PC. After installation, run TransMac as an administrator. This is a paid software, but it gives a 15-day free trial, which is more than enough for our task. Right-click on the USB drive and choose Restore with Disk Image. Click Yes. Choose the macOS DMG file that you have downloaded. Now, it will start creating a bootable USB drive. It will take some time as the DMG file is quite large. Once done, safely eject the USB drive from your PC. Now you have a bootable USB drive for macOS installation. You can just plug the USB into a Mac computer where you want to install the macOS. If you have an M-chip Mac, Press and hold the power button to open the boot menu. Release the power key when you see the boot menu is loading message. On the boot options, choose the macOS installer volume. This will start the macOS installation process. So guys, you have learned how to create a Mac bootable USB on Windows. Hope this video helps you out. 